for question 10, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to start by counting the number of atoms present. So if we're looking at selenium right here, we're going to look up in our equation. We're going to see that it has no subscript, which means it has one atom. For chlorine, we have six atoms of chlorine, Cl6 right there. And oxygen on the reactant side, we're going to see that we have two atoms of oxygen for O2. Looking at the product side, we have one atom of selenium. We have two atoms of oxygen. So down here next to oxygen, we're going to write two. And for chlorine, we have two atoms of chlorine. One and one is even for selenium, so that's balanced. Chlorine, two and six. Two goes into six three times, so we're going to change this here to be a coefficient of three. Three times two is going to be six. Now we have one and one for selenium, six and six for chlorine, and two and two for oxygen. So this equation is balanced just with that one coefficient.